this notability video, um, we are going to be discussing the themes and uh, defaults and how to change those uh, inside of your settings. So I'm in version 5.41 still. And on the bottom left hand corner here, I'm going to select my settings icon. And let's go down to themes. So themes, you can turn on this thing called dark mode and it just, it looks kind of cool, uh, changes everything to dark and, you know, but <clears throat> I'm going to keep it on light mode for now just because uh, I think it looks a little bit better for the screen casting, though dark mode is pretty cool. Um, also, you can turn on and off the colorful subjects. Uh, let me show you, let me close out, let me expand some of these and go back into my settings. You can see that it, when you turn off your colorful subjects, it's still got the colors, but they're just little dots that are next to whatever they are. So up to you, whatever you like is fine. <clears throat> now the defaults for the documents itself, whenever you create a new note, um, you can choose to have it, like right now mine is selected to be lined I don't know if you can see that outline there in blue. Um, I could change that to be blank. <clears throat> so I could change the color up top here. And then down on the bottom, the bottom two rows, I could change the paper type to where it's lined. It's, and I can change the spacing of the lines or I can have it default to be a grid. So let's say I want mine to default to be a grid and I want it to be this green color. I don't really know why, but let's say I want that. I uh, just select what I want. I can hit close. And then um, let's say I'm taking some notes on proportions and I want to create a new note. And there we go. You can see that it is defaulted to the green uh, grid paper here which would be pretty nice for, you know, drawing some graphs, showing proportionality, all that good stuff. So that was a short uh, little video on themes and some of your default settings here. And also you can see that it is still, my auto backup is working, which I really do appreciate inside of Notability.